Last Thursday was Fall Family Festival at Northwest Christian Church. And I again want to thank everybody who donated their time, who donated all that candy, and all of you who prayed, and all of you who served. We had a record attendance at every one of our campuses. So I just want to say, way to go. And it was so great to hear from so many that were inviting their one to the Fall Family Festival, because that's a great opportunity to invite. Now, would you continue to pray for those who come who still don't have a church? And continue to pray in general for our ones. We have a lot to get after. Well, we are also in the home stretch of our One More Vision Initiative message series. So in a couple weeks, we're gonna receive the commitments for our two-year initiative so that we can get after our God-sized goal. And so we can continue to express unprecedented compassion, extend unlimited hope, and experience uncompromising faith. So continue to pray. Please continue to pray that we finish strong and that we reach our number one primary goal of 100% participation, that every person who calls NCC home will engage with God in this new season of extraordinary vision, generosity, and discipleship. Well, Julie and I were also in Johnson City, Tennessee this week. We were at the Christian Missionary Fellowship board meeting and part of that board for a number of years. Now, it's a lot of work, there's a lot of meetings, but there are many blessings and one of those blessings is to hear updates from our missionaries from around the world. Now, NCC, we support several missionaries through our missions giving who serve under the CMF umbrella. Tony Cole, he works with university students in Tübingen, Germany, as part of the Global Scope Campus Ministry. So he was there, and we got to pray for him and get caught up. It was great. We also got to see one of our favorite people of all time, Roy Lawson, and just want to let you know he is doing well. And then later, Julie and I, we took our first tour of Milligan University and Emmanuel Seminary, two iconic situations, institutions for the Christian church. Then we were also able to connect with David and Casey Hosteller, who moved there a couple years ago. We had dinner together at Cootie Brown's. I think that might have been started by Cooter Ray's granny. Well, hope you've had a great week so far. Look forward to seeing you this weekend.